Hey everybody, this is Pastor Ben Lim here, and today I want to expose the false occult of Trumpism. A number of people are saying that Trumpism is an occult, okay? But I want to talk to you about exposing the false occult of Trumpism. First and foremost, let me talk to you. What is an occult, okay? An occult is a group or a sect of people that are usually involved in religious or spiritual activities okay that's where we get the word culture from because culture is in a sense a form of the occult but many times the occult has negative uh, connotations and we see that all throughout the bible uh, even apostle paul addresses the occult group in the book of galatians who has bewitched you to believe in a different doctrine or a different gospel so many people are saying that trumpism is a weird false occult but i want to expose it and i want to show you and tell you what actually is an occult and how having honor and love for our president is far from being a false occult first and foremost an occult has firm legalism and control an occult is all about control it takes away your rights takes away your freedom of speech, takes away your freedom to assemble. It takes away your freedom to bear arms. An occult has strong powers of control and force and will do anything and whatever it takes to control the people and the minds of the sheeplings. An occult controls and doesn't care about humanity and the sacredness of any human being. Number two, an occult is all about manipulation. It uses secrets and information to blackmail you, and it uses information to manipulate you into fear, to manipulate the truth and to deceive you so that you may be blindsided and you may be stuck in a constant spiral of false information. All right, an occult will always move you into heresy which means it is a false understanding of the Bible, of the Word of God, and it adds on different truths, false truths, to it. That's an occult. Number three, idolatry. There is a great fantasy or there's a great idolatry of its leader, making the charismatic, strong, outspoken leader, making it an idol above God and above Jesus. You cannot be saved unless you follow this occult leader. You cannot enter in to the next level unless you follow this occult leader. Jesus himself says that there is no other door except through me. An occult is all about idolizing the untouchable leader, idolizing this leader that is high and above and so holy, and that is a false messiah figure. Number four, an occult is about censorship. Whatever they can do, they do not want you to speak. They do not want you to think for yourself. An occult will do all that it can to make sure that there is no other voices, there is no other thoughts. It's like communism and socialism. Communism has one narrative and that's it. If you think or oppose anything else that goes against it, then you will be killed. That is an occult. Very extreme, isn't it? Number five, an occult will threaten you and bully you. Anybody who's been in an occult knows that there's strong harassment, physical harassment. There's even physical abuse. There's physical attacks. There's verbal abuse. There's bullying. There's emotional abuse. But whenever you are in an occult, there is threatening and there is bullying and people are afraid for their lives. They're afraid for their safety. If they ever turn on this mafia, if they ever turn on this occultic group, then they are afraid because they're going to come after them and they're going to kill them and murder everybody that you love and that is close to them. Doesn't this sound like the mafia? Doesn't this sound like Thug 101 or like they're gangsters? Well, that's what an occultic group is. They will stop at nothing to destroy your humanity and your reputation because you have a different thought or because you've turned on them. 
That is the extremism of an occult. Number six, an occult demands that you are isolated and you stay away from your family and your friends. This is horrible. This is such a horrid situation. An occulted group separates you and splits you from friends and family. It cuts off ties and cuts off all contact so that you cannot have help or communication with any other form of truth. An occult will make sure that you are isolated and continuously inundated with only their agenda and their information. An occult will make you and force you to cut off all ties with anybody else that is outside with this occultic group. That is an occult. An occult leads you astray. Number seven, leads you astray from the Bible and the Word of God. There's false teachings. There's heresies. It adds on, oh, this pastor, this person, because this person didn't say this, because our charismatic leader didn't say this, it must be false, and I'm not going to listen to it. That is extreme, folks. You and I were meant to think for ourselves, and we're meant to have the mind of Christ. We're meant to adhere the Bible, not any other added on text or verses or books or literature. It's only the Bible, only the Word that stands. Number eight, there is sexual immorality. Okay, There is pedophilia. There is continual sexual abuse, orgies. Uh, you know, bestiality, uh, pedophilia, there's incense, there's all of these wicked, evil, immoral things that take place. Many times in occults, there is sexual immoral relations within its followers and the leaders on and on continuously. And if you don't, then you are shamed, you are shunned. In occults, your body belongs to the leader. In occultic groups, your purity, your virginity, your innocence belongs to the leader. In occults, you are demanded, in a sense, to be a sex slave and to continue to only do what the leader demands. That is extremism of an occult that is far from what President Trump is doing and has done. Very far. Number nine, an occult will condemn you if you are not loyal to death. There is a false sense of loyalty. There is a false sense of commitment. And an occult makes you sign your name with blood on a dotted line and makes these covenants and contracts that are false. An occult is all about blood covenants, blood sacrifices. It's all about false commitment. And they will make you be loyal unto death. Otherwise, you will be condemned you will be shunned. You will be shamed. You will be ostracized. Occults are very dangerous. They are very destructive. And number 10, occults make you seek permission from its leader if you want to do anything for yourself. Listen, people, this is not communist China. This is not socialism. We do not need permission to do and to move. We don't need permission to have to break our curfew. We don't need permission to assemble and gather. We don't need permission to have the freedom of speech and to share our thoughts. We don't need permission. This is the United States of America. This is not an occult. We have the freedom according to the Word of God and the Constitution. Many people are saying that Trumpism is an occult, but I want to tell you that's far from the truth. We love our president. We honor our president. The Bible says to honor those who are in office and those who are our elders and in government positions. We may disagree with them, but at least honor them and pray for them and bless them. The Bible also says that they are servants to us. We do not work for the government. The government works for us. And so today... We must understand that Trumpism is not an occult. In fact, I am exposing that Trumpism is not an occult. Okay, We must understand what an occult really is. And that's communism, that's socialism, that's control, that's tyranny. 
If you go against any of these thoughts, then you'll be killed. You'll be canceled. You'll be shut down. You'll be shunned. You'll be shamed. They will, they will bring the mob and they'll threaten you and they'll shut down your business. They will gather and they will harass you and they will vandalize your property. Like the mob. That is not Trumpism. That is not what it means to have a love and an honor and a gratitude to our current president that has done so much, even for the Christian voice and the Christian faith in this country. People of God, don't be fooled. Occults are very dangerous, are very extreme, and they destroy and they kill. Having a love for our president is not an occult. Don't be fooled, people. This is Pastor Ben Lip with exposing the false occult of Trumpism.